Good morning from Discover Real Estate. This is Natalie. Today I am outside Bayview Terrace townhouses. There's five townhouses here. I'm going to video the one on the left. Um, this is in La Talangera. So this road takes you to the beach. You're about three blocks from the public beach access. And if you go this way, it takes you up to the Chocolata Road. So it's got gated off street parking. There's security cameras here 24 seven. There's a, um, a person working here. So there's security on site. There's one of the caretakers. Hey, Hello. <laughs> so there's always somebody here, lots of parking. So you've got plenty of gated off street parking over here on the right is the office building. And then there's also a laundry room that is shared by everybody. So you have access to laundry facilities for the five units here. And they have a backup generator. So if the power's off for a long time, they can start the generator too. Um, there's two access points into this building, the parking lot below. And then also there's a gate up here at the top, which gives you access from the Chocolata Road. So. Um, but there's no parking up at the top. But so if you're with a taxi or something and you're being dropped off, you can get dropped off at the top gate and then you don't have to come up all these stairs. Or if you have a lot of groceries, you can park up here, unload your car and then take your car down below. So not a problem there. So this gate here is really nice if you're unloading groceries and stuff and you don't have to take them up the stairs. But the stairs are not steep. They're easy to get up and down. One of the benefits of this, it's an end unit. So it's got some windows on the side and you've got a little extra patio space on the side here too. This is a storage unit. So it gives you access to your electric panels. There's water available right outside here. So there's a little bit of space in there that you can add, you know, keep your cleaning supplies, stuff like that if you want. And it goes here to where the crease in the wall is. So just past this window, this is the kitchen window. Let me take you into the townhouse. Ah, she's got it nice and cool. She left the air conditioning on for me. So this is one of the best decorated ones I've been in. This one is beautiful and, um, and it's much, much better than the other townhouses here. They, and it comes fully furnished also, so. You've got lots of seating space here in the living room. Nice dining area. This painting, her our piece of artwork does not come with it. So, uh, and then we've got the kitchen. You've got two bar stools here at the kitchen. Nice, nice piece of woodwork for the bar. Nice countertops in the kitchen. Nice backsplash. This whole townhouse is so much better the way they've um, kept it up and redone certain features and stuff so you've got a view from your kitchen sink out to the back they got the exhaust hood over the stove so cool little cubbies right here to store stuff nice shelf and then this is a half a bathroom here. So if you have gas or you don't want to run upstairs to go to the bathroom, you can go here. Just if you're tall, smack your head. So you got to be careful on that one. Um, and then the staircase to go up to the two bedrooms. You've got this window here for natural light in the staircase. And she added a mirror. Hello. So I like the mirror at the top of the staircase. Um, this bedroom here on the right, this is the guest bedroom. So you've got two bedrooms up here, very nicely done. Nice curtains, nice closet doors. The closets in the other ones are not nearly as nice. You think, oh, maybe it's locked, <laughs> okay, so. And then this also has a patio off of the upper level. And from the patio, you have a peekaboo ocean view, not, not a big ocean view, 
and you can see some of the bay at the very end of town um, down by well the restaurants you can see in front of all the restaurants and you see Casa Marina the five-story building down there but you do see a statue of Jesus too which they have him lit up at night which is very very nice and over there is the pool. I'll show you the pool also that comes, you have a shared pool with this complex. So, so this patio is shared by both bedrooms. Let me go back in to the bedroom. But I love the colors and just everything that she's done here is very, very nice. I like it when artists decorate places. A nice mirror. Nice light fixture, so, decent shower head, um, and you've got a little window in the shower, which is very nice. So uh, now, this is the master bedroom here, and one thing um, I did in I because I used to manage another one here. Um, we made this opening here a doorway. So we put a door in here so that way the master bedroom, you don't have to go from this door into your bathroom. We remove this door and put it here in the hallway. So that way you just have a door directly into the bedroom. Oh, well they have this one set up differently. This is the guest bedroom. The other one, this is the master bedroom, how they have it set up. And then this is actually the guest. But if you wanna make this one the master bedroom, you can change the door around and have it more of a master bedroom, but I love this bathroom. The colors are fantastic. Look at that. Lights on. So you've got a nice big shower and a shelf in the shower. And the window that opens, which is nice. So yeah. When an artist does a bathroom, it comes out really cool. So this is just a cool bathroom. I really, really like it. Um, and then this is set up as the guest bedroom. So they've got storage under here. And then you, you've got the closet space with just the, the curtain in front of it. But if you wanted tracks, you could put you know some sliding tracks on or something like that. So they're golfers, so they got their golf bag here. They put a mirror on this door, which is really cool. And then this goes out onto the patio where we saw before. And you've got the tray ceilings in here and ceiling fans. So you've got the nice ceilings in both bathrooms. So, or both bedrooms, I mean. We've got the tray ceiling in this one also. And this is a cool piece of artwork. The wall is curved here, so that they did something that allowed them to follow the curve of the wall, which is really cool. I may not fall down the steps as I'm videoing and walking. Now I'll take you out onto the patio. They have a great patio space. They've tinted these windows to give a little bit of extra um, protection from the sun. But this is a fantastic patio. So you've got space on this side in front of the dining room area and you have more space on this side to the right. So they have a unique door closing system. This is a weighted bottle and you let the screen door go and the bottle weight drops and closes the screen door. So a little bit of creativity. So, but this is kind of like a potting area for them. So they've got lots of plants and stuff here and they've got their smoker grill. And it's very private feeling because you're the last townhouse on the end so nobody comes to your patio unless they're visiting you you don't have anybody just walking by you and you've got this little bit of extra space out in the front here too and back along the side so if you wanted to put more plants or something like that you could do that also you've got some lemongrass here which is great for keeping the mosquitoes away and just nice nice 
plants, nice furniture, nice use of the space for privacy. Now let me take you to the uh, pool area. This is a pool that is shared by the five units. So it's got a nice waterfall feature. It's nice and deep, which is a wonderful thing. And the ergonomically correct chairs, lounge chairs are, in, are a nice place to hang out. But you've got a bench underneath the waterfall that you can sit on or a bench here in this corner. There is a shower, an outdoor shower here. So that's, um, it's a cool feature. It comes out the little tube. So it's like a, and that's a little waterfall. And then this is the pool pump room. The, uh, the, the waterfall feature is fabulous because it blocks out the road noise and everything. So you sit out here and just relax. Here's a little puppy. <laughs> Hey. Here comes another puppy. <laughs> so it is a pet friendly development. You can have pets here if you want, not a problem. But just nice landscaping along here, all these flowers. It's always in bloom, it's always pretty looking. And let me take you back in and sh show you one more time the inside. I love the screen door closure. That's fabulous. An engineer probably did that one. <laughs> that would be Dan, the owner. Um, but yeah, here are the tray ceilings. This nice lighting over the bar. Everything is beautiful. Nice comfy couches to sit in and relax and watch the nice big screen TV. I love my life. Come join me.